All right, good Urchi Avatar. Not the Petrid one. Also, not very tanky. It kind of hurts, though. It's like half my health, almost. That's, I think, one of the things that, like, I wouldn't even say, like, your damage is necessarily, I don't know, it depends on the weapon, I guess, you're using, but, like, you can have low damage in NG+, and, like, it would kind of be a challenge, except for the fact that so many enemies really don't do any damage to you at all. That's, I think, the main issue, especially with, like, a lot of Limgrave bosses, because you can have so much health, like, Margit does barely nothing for you. I might, like, limit my health uh, when I do these runs. Unless I'm using, like, a really bad weapon. Like, if I'm using a decent weapon, I might just, like, cap it at 40 for, like, certain areas. Although the Dragon Bear is going to be a pain with that. But, like, maybe I don't bump it up to 50 until, like, I don't know, maybe the mountaintop or something. And then 60 by the end of the game, because, like, really, there's nowhere else to put your points at that point. Like, my Vigor right now is, uh, 50. It's at 45, but the Source Seal gives me 50. Might be time to take it off soon, though. Everything else is, uh, everything important, anyway, is getting up to, you know, a high enough level where the extra levels don't really mean much. Because I think the only other thing I get from it that would be good is strength. And, like, it doesn't really matter that much for this build. I don't think this weapon has any strength ceiling. I took it off. Oh, it does, but it's E, so yeah. Really nothing. Okay. It... I don't remember where the... Okay. This wall. They're still chasing me, huh? Seen that uh, shack once or twice. <laughs> All right, bowls, carrion knight, and dragon. Then academy crystal cave. I gotta actually do like a storm sword key run. I think I only need one or two in the Urnia, but I need a lot in Altus and Mount Tops. They should have given, I think, things way more help. Because again, it's not like I was even over leveled in New Game. I think I did one extra boss than I needed to, which was Radon. Actually, I did Nile, didn't I? Did I do Nile? I think I did. To get the eights. But it's not like I'm over leveled. I might be now. I don't know, it's hard to say what even is overleveled in New Game Plus. Anything above level one is overleveled. 
Wait, there are blutterers here? I don't know why I'm picking this up, but I didn't know that. I mean, it's not a convenient blood rose spot, but, I, you know, still kind of cool, I guess. Uh, what's happening? No. That is two. Okay, so I have one key. I don't think I need any more keys for Lyrnia, though. Nothing's coming to mind. This is Duo Crystalli, and literally nothing is worse than the trio, so. The trio is in, I think, the. Or like, I think the area the trio is in is the most difficult out of all the areas there are Crystallians in. Plus, it's got Scarlet Rot, plus there's three of them. Like, nothing's worse than that one. I should say, as far as the bosses go, the the hailing tree uh, crystallians are most certainly worse. I don't think they get the same like protection that these ones get. Or, I don't know if protection is the right word, but like they they intentionally made the boss ones less aggressive. That's like the only way to actually counter that move is to uh, just backstab him, really. Strafe the whole attack. Three bosses here, plus we need to get the study all grace. Uh, where is this grace? I don't remember. Is it up ahead? Yes. I think it's this one. Oh, no. This one works. It's gotta be this one. I can't remember if there's like a... I think this is Lyrnia Highway North, which I, is the one I want, but I wonder if it makes sense to go a... I don't know. I don't think it does. I think that's the one I need. Or the best one. The one I usually go for. Yeah, it is. And I always run past this every single time I run past this catacombs. So I'm just going to hug the wall. I can't see anything, though.
I still feel like I went past it. Is it up here? That's probably why. It's because it's like in the way. Can you make that? Oh, you can. Look at the level. Back, back with coffee. All right, which catacombs is this? I know the boss. I just never remember the actual layout of this dungeon. No, I remember it. I lied. Kind of. Do we go left or right? That's what I don't remember. Ow! I am in trouble. I think. Climb. Climb! Ah, it's too fast. Yo, ma'am, chill. Oh, that's not good. Ooh. All right, Knight's Cavalry number, I don't even know. That's like, I think the most annoying thing about this run is like killing all the Knight's Calvaries. Like, I don't mind killing repeat bosses most of the time, except for the Knight's Cavalry. Even the Deathrite Bird, like, there's not that many. There's four, it's like whatever. But having to do nine Knight's Cavalries is just like, ugh. Because they just run. Like, they spend so much time running, it's like... Not that fun. Oh, come on. Hey, come over here. What? Hello? What? I've literally never seen this bear in my life. Probably not true, but I've literally never had it be a problem in this fight since I started doing all bosses. Oh my god. Should probably use the Sash of War more, too. I really haven't. Tibia Mariner. Where is it? The pinwheel of the game. And he's gone. I don't think Pinwheel's a fair comparison. Like, he's got... Oh, nice. The ease of Pinwheel, sure. Oh, that's not good. 
But, like, they don't really work the same, you know? Like, he summons a bunch of skeletons. I guess Pinwheel summons himself. I'm trying to see if I can stagger him with this. It's not really working, though. Like, if you're gonna die to anything in this fight, it's gonna be the, the, the summons. I mean, maybe you die to him if, like, the summons take you down to low HP, but, like, you really shouldn't be dying to anything else besides summons. Let's hope I can go this way. I think there's a bridge here to like the other part near the Church of Vows, and I can get down from there to the study hall. There's a skip, I think, but like I, I don't know how to do it. Apparently, it kind of sucks. Eh. I don't know if this is the best way, but it is a way. Like I, there's gotta be somewhere you can jump down onto, like something. I guarantee you can jump onto those rocks right there. But, like, yeah, I don't know it, and I'm not going to risk doing it now. I feel like I can jump to that, though. Aww, uh, it seems so doable. I don't want to risk it, though. Whoa, hello! Let's not jump off of that. Yeah, there's like no good way over here unless you do like some crazy skip. Like maybe you can jump off of that onto this rock here? I don't know. What else is uh, coming up? I think now we go do... I want to say Deathrite Bird. Let's see, what do I have on my list here? Oh, not even. We'll do the uh, Volcano Man or Warp, though. Um... We'll do the Noble, Abductive Virgin Duo. And then we'll do, we'll finish Caleb. Then come back to the room. I don't know why I get on torrent for like two seconds and then get off, but here we are. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the warp, the noble, the duo. Then I'm going to do the wind of ruins bosses, and then we'll go to red main.
wonder what the lore is behind these, uh, these funny looking hats of these guys. Because there's gotta be something, right? Maybe, like, they're the, uh... It's like a caricature of an old sorcerer or something. There's gotta be something, right? You would think? Maybe they became mutated and they actually have really large heads and they all look the same. I don't know. The lore is there is no lore. This Oh, I think I can make that. No. Okay, I'm fine. Still need like eight more golden seeds. There's plenty to get, but I should have to actually get them. I mean, there's like four in the outskirts, so. Okay, I didn't lower my health before I came here, so this might be a little scuffed. Or it's perfect. I mean, as cool as I think this is for like a casual experience, like I almost wish it wasn't a thing. Because like this, being able to warp here can make you so OP early. Uh, I think I have to go over here to jump down. Like, being able to get somber 5, 6, and 7 right at the start of the game. And eight and nine, like I really wish they gated the sombers behind, uh, like the mountain tops or something. At least like eight and nine. Like the fact that you can get a plus nine weapon before Margit is insane. I hoping I'd have time to roll up. Fireball.
This is very Pontiff-like, though, this arena. Kind of. Well, I have more columns here, but... A little bit of Pontiff vibes. From the arena. It's like the same shape, basically. It's just a lot smaller. Okay, so you can actually... I, I didn't know this until the other day, but... You can actually go over here. I don't know where it is, but you can drop down and basically get to the duo fight. Right here. Oh, I thought I missed it. Which is sick. Because, like, the way I was doing it before, it was just so insanely awkward to, like, have to do this twice, essentially. You have to do, like, ha I, I did the warp twice, because... I didn't realize you could do this. And, like, the way I do this run might not be super efficient, but, like, I try to make it a little bit efficient, you know? Because, like, you want to get done in a reasonable amount of time. And I guess reasonable is relative to, you know, each individual. But, like, absolutely unreasonable would be, you know, going through Volcano Manor instead of just doing the warp. Because that just takes much longer. Hundred eighty one K runes. Let's try not to lose them. Not gonna reach. I think the wheel guy's more important here, to be honest. Because this one actually charges you. Why does this fight suck? Ah, oh, that's hatchback timing. Sure, no one was going to do that though. I think I need this grace for anything, so we're just gonna ignore it. I'll get this one, we'll do the Tibia Mariner and the Catacombs, and then we're gonna go to Red Main. To be a mariner, where are you? You know, I thought he was gonna go away. I'm, I'm kind of surprised he's still here. I thought he was gonna tell. Oh, there he teleported. That's why I stayed on Torrent, because I'm like, I know he's gonna leave. I 
I feel like this probably wasn't a boss always, and then they just kind of made it one. Because, like, the fact that the, the one of the mountaintops isn't a boss, it's, like, the only reason I feel that way. It's, like, they just forgot that one. Touch that. I hit that switch like every single time. Oh, this is the really annoying one where it's better to just die, huh? Ah. Uh. Yep, chill. Are you not dead? You are not dead. I cannot believe you are not dead. Like, there's gotta be a... I don't remember how you get back, like, if you take the normal way. Oh, you go underneath, I remember now. Like, it's faster to just die here, because you have to go through so much to backtrack. Oh, okay. And usually you die there anyways, because it's like you got this imp here, and you got this knight here. I don't even care about the runes, honestly. I wasn't trying to die there, but you know, maybe it's for the best. Lost a lot of runes today, though. Probably a million. They're close to it, at least. is the best place to go to? Probably here. A bit lost script, because I, uh, the notes I have for this run, I forgot to change. So I gotta remember that I did the Tibia Mariner and the Windham Ruins or Catacombs, whatever they're called, and the Noble. I think if we go this way, the Golden Seed is, like, right over here somewhere. Maybe it's up more? I don't know where it is. I guess it's up more. Here it is. We're done. will be easy. That's another sad fight in New Game Plus, too. Like, I wish Redon was harder in New Game Plus, but alas, he is not.
The putrid avatar will be, though. So three more fights here, and then Kaelid is done. Limgrave's already done. Liernia won't be done for, like, almost till the end of the run. Nor, I guess, will Altus technically, because you have the Ashen Capital, which is, like, the very end. Plus, Reichardt, I always say, for, like, the end. Like, I finished the Mountaintops before I finish... Before I finish Altus. And maybe Lyrnia? I don't even know. I don't remember how I ordered everything. Sandwich isn't like as good as I thought. Like it's fine, but like it's not a, as good as I thought it would be. His damage is pretty low though. So. I'm gonna die to redone. I'm dead. Oh my god, I can't believe I rolled up. Phase two, phase two. That is insanely sloppy. Camera is like freaking out. Two hundred thirty five K. I think um, you get that Elden Ring icon like whenever the, the world changes. So like because like Nakron has to be opened up, like I think the reason you get that is whenever something like that happens. Like there's an I think the only other instance is when you get the Ashen Capital. I don't really know what happens either. Like I don't know if like it just changes like that specific area or if you literally get teleported to like a copied version of the map. I don't actually know what happens. But those are the, I think the only two times aside from the beginning where that happens. Which I'm guessing it's it's probably something similar though. Like I I I have a feeling that there's like two versions of um, the precipice or Church of Anticipation, whatever it's called. There's like the the one at the beginning of the game where it's like super stormy, and then when you come back, it's like a lot more calm. And that's like after that is the only other time I think you get that same Elden Ring loading symbol or whatever. It's like the world state has changed or something. 
All right. So we'll go... I'm going to go Endurance. I'm going to hold off on leveling, leveling Vigor for now. And then I think we can take the Sword Seal off once we're like 50 on everything. Because it's really not going to do much. Like, again, the only other thing I'm going to get that's going to be useful is Strength, and it's not even got to be that much of a difference. So I'm really just kind of taking extra damage for no reason. In fact, I think I'm just going to take it off now. Oh, wrong way. I was worried I was going to get the somewhere a heavy door is open message as I was getting hit by the arrow and not be able to roll it. Like, what's the difference between 1581, 1704, like, it's like 120 health. Eh, you know what, I'll, I, nah, I'll take it off. I think once you hit like all the the soft caps at like 40 or whatever, like it probably still helps, but like, I don't know. I'm not too worried about not using it. I'm, I don't know the timing on that, dude. I feel like I need to practice this boss because it's just a nightmare of just getting the right timings and learning what he's even doing, because you can't tell half the time. Like, that slam attack's insanely delayed. Please, let me hit you. Ah, oh, that's good. You got I don't even know what's going on. Super delayed attack. I forgot to get golden seeds from these dudes too. Okay. Go talk to Jaren. Then we got this duo fight.
kill. Our brave chaps sell them faster. If I'm no longer I have a task. Old visit. May we meet. Misbegone Crucible. Always fun. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot I moved Ronnie's like starting Ronnie's quest to after this too. It's, I think you get less dialogue after fighting for Dawn. You don't have to talk to Blythe. Which saves some time. Every time is so bad. Ace two. What? I've rolled, man. You pretty much just have to, like, expect the tail after every attack. It sucks. It's like the last thing you want to have to do is wait for an attack that he might not even do. But, yeah, it is what it is. Like, that's the reason I don't like Phase 2 or this Crucible Knight that much. Also hate that if you get hit by that first tail, you can't even roll the second one because you just get staggered. Okay, make sure I'm going to the right place. I think it's the Death Right Bird. Yes. In Lyurnia. South. This. South Ray Lucaria Gate. Right, then we'll do... that'll be 50. That's capped. The dex is almost at the soft cap. Really? How did I die there? I don't even know where the stake is. There's another skip I've seen in speedruns here, but I don't know how to do it. I have no idea how I died there, though. I think Torrent must have died. It must have just been Torrent, because I, I still had, like, health. I don't know how I'm dying here. I've never, I've never had a problem here. All right, well, I know another way I can go. I mean, I've literally did this on like every other run. I don't know what the problem is now. You jump over to this. I don't know exactly where you jump off that. Maybe behind this tree. Yeah. Yeah, I have no idea what happened there. Is that a bear? There's a bear here? That's completely random.
I had no idea there was a bear here. I think it's a little bear, but like still. I do not uh, safely know how to avoid that attack at all. I don't know what you can do there to not get hit. Please stop staggering me. Oh, this is a bad attack. That's the you will die no matter what attack. Jesus Christ. The key to this fight, I think, honestly, is like using your using Torrent for a lot of stuff. It feels like they want you to use Torrent. Because I don't know how you're supposed to dodge a lot of the stuff if you just say on foot. Please, just die. I'm dead. Oh my god. What a nightmare. There's like no easy death right bird. It's it's always like always tough. That's the easiest one. And even that was a struggle. Have I picked up a map this run? I have not picked up one. favorite enemy. Oh my god. Don't jump over him. I will have to try uh, healing against this guy because it's supposed to be like the magic key. But I've never bothered to try it. I mean, I, I only did one playthrough where I actually had healing. I don't know if talking to EG now even really matters. I'm going to skip him. I have no reason to talk to him. Like, it might save time uh, in Ronnie's Rise. I don't know, but it, probably not much, honestly. actually almost done with Lyurnia. 
for for now anyway there's still more but like uh later on but it's this onyx lord uh a tunnel knight's cavalry and then the magma worm that's it And then I think I'm going to do my note. I'm looking at my notes right now on my other monitor, and they are just not right. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm going to get the uh, Sage's Torch. You know what? I don't even need the Sage's Torch for that Black Knife Assassin in the cave. I, I needed it for the bow one, because, like, otherwise you have to free aim it. But I don't really need it for this. So I think I'll just do it anyways. I'll do it as I have it. This is uh, another flask. Venice slash. Actually, you know what? It's hard to tell from here, but it might honestly be faster to get this grace. Go to Ronnie's Rise, do all that, and then warp back here to get to the Onyx Lord. Like, I don't think it would save, or, you know, just... Is it ever here? Where is this grace? It, clearly it's not here. Yeah, okay. That bug is annoying. Feels like this would be faster. Even though you don't really get a horse for like half of this, but like Ronnie's rise is way over here.
Go around here. Thou must have, though I have no intrigue. Mm. Wilt thou? I am the will that I might well. I thought that I require tis. I love how she just kind of like Who asks you to. to go there All right. So can I? What do I do here? Do I have to talk to these guys or this? I. I don't know. I like the heed not. The, I'm sure the. Uh, the dialogue order. Like I, I need, need to learn that. Like, I don't know how much I need to talk to Ronnie and when I can stop, and then when I have to go talk to these guys. Celibus. I hear I am. I don't know what since I are. I reside in. No one cares, man. You've defeated a grand pleasure, Kari and I. Let together. All right, that's it there. Uh, Ronnie's going to take a nap. Uh, I shall, and it will be this doll's. But still, I look. Okay. Here? Here. Probably here. Onyx Lord shouldn't be too bad. He's just a guy. That's it. 